We are at the largest talent show Knoxville has ever hosted. Welcome everyone. We are live at the Knoxville Convention Center where thousands, probably 2,000 plus at this point, thousands of people have walked through these doors to audition for America's Got Talent. We've seen some incredible talent. Boy, have we such variety. We've been preparing for these auditions for several weeks, and I must say it has lived up to all of the hype. America's Got Talent staff, they have done an incredible job of getting thousands of people and their families and their friends and their support groups in the Knoxville Convention Center, and they have been auditioning since 7 this morning. You heard Robin give the total count. They're expecting 3,000 by day's end, and you can audition if you get here by 7. Okay, so our Cole Sullivan has has been here since 10 o'clock this morning, seen some interesting acts, talent. One in particular, Cole, involving a very unique banjo. Tell us about it. Yeah, exactly. Some of this talent has taken months, years, years of practice and, and thousands of dollars of lessons. This particular uh, performer found his instrument in the back of his pantry. Take a look. I'm Stacy Cody, I'm from Talbot, and I play a spam can. It's called a spam joke. Since we're in Tennessee, I'll try to do something uh, that everybody would recognize. So. What's the story behind the green suit? I just want to be handsome today. Bring a little sunshine, so I like green and uh, I think it kind of suits me. He says he's been practicing that for three weeks now and he's hoping it's the talent that's enough to get him to win America's Got Talent. He's going in front of the judges today to see if that will work. We'll send it back to you.